It's me, Kelly. So today's video that I'm doing is a come thrift with me. I know these are very popular on YouTube, so I was like, why not like go do it? Because it seems fun. And right now we are at a, a good whale. Can I? I don't know if I can switch the camera, but we'll just. Hopefully that's in frame. There. <laughs> um, I'm with my mom. Doesn't want to be on camera. So she'll be my little camera woman today and hopefully we find some good things here. Let's get on with the video. So we're starting off great, you know, we got a pink Fendi purse. Um, don't know if it's real or not. It's only $5, so woohoo. Moving on to shoes over here. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of those shoes and a lot of sandals, so let's see what I find. Okay, so so far I found this belt. Thought it was cute because it was two holes. Okay. Then I found this Coca-Cola guys like sweatshirt. I actually buy Coca-Cola. Woohoo. A lot of red. Mickey Mouse. In the back. Looks like that. Like I said, a lot of red. And then this Nautica fleece. This is Nautica on the back. And then we have a bunch of jeans we're gonna try on. Oh, and I have a bunch of shirts and skirts and stuff, so we'll do that. So, lighting on here is like super bad, but that's okay. Outfit of the day, got this hat. All this is thrifted, by the way, except for my shoes. Hat, Goodwill. Shirt, cropped it myself, woo. Belt, I think I got a Target. <laughs> Salvation Army for my pants. Shoes, you know, my Adidas. So, I know we're not supposed to have the cart in here, but I do. So, we're gonna try some jeans on, and yeah, let's just do it. So, shirt, like, it's not as tight as I want it to be. It is polo, and I just thought, like, the zip up and collar would be cute, but it's not as tight as I'd like it to be. And we're not even gonna talk about these pants. They're um, where's the thing? They're Levi's, um, little boys, size 14, and they fit good around the waist, but they're just, I just can't deal with the leg, but, yeah, so this kind of outfit is a no, just cause it's, uh, I don't, I just don't like the fit of any of it. <laughs> okay, yeah, but. These are Levi's as well, size 16, do not fit me, like you can see my underwear. And these are a little better, I don't know, at the leg, not really, still have the same shirt on, but I just look like I'm sagging or do like, I just, just no. <laughs> So, um, I mean, this could like be a look, you know, like office girl, but like, skirt, <laughs> I don't know if you can tell, it does not fit me at all, like look at that, does not fit, but this BB top, pretty cute, has the collar, zip up, fitted, kinda like it, don't know if I'll get it though, just cause it's like a style that's not really in, but it's BB. The skirt can't. <laughs> just, I tried. But the skirt, I really tried. But this can be a look if it actually fit. Um, but it doesn't. So, I don't know about the top. We'll see. Um, yeah, that's all I have. So, yeah. Okay, update. We are at another Goodwill. If you can see that, all the way in that back window. Another Goodwill and stopped at Caribou Coffee, which you, a lot of you don't know what that is because it's like a Minnesota thing. So I got a mint condition mocha blended because I don't want a hot drink on it's like 
50 something degrees so that's like summer or spring for us because we've been like in snow as like the snow's melting outside like if you can see there's snow i don't know if you can see any of that or if that was just like an ugly shot but got my coffee and we're gonna thrift some more woo so i'm looking for like a silk long sleeve to like tie up you know that kind of look and or sheer um so far not seeing seeing anything got some mickey mouse stuff um got pink polka dots i want like full on like silk not like sheer like this i want silk which is kind of hard like the pj kind of feel so we'll see if we find it that's kind of cute kind of not When you find a jacket that's your name as a brand, Kelly, Mike Clinton Kelly. It's a cute jacket, wouldn't wear it though. So, it's looking at a blazer back. Ooh, we got some Tommy jeans. Come get that. I'm not really a blazer kind of person, but I'm trying to be. But I don't really see anything. How about a hot pink? You know. <laughs> This is kind of cute. I like the little tie, tie design. We also got some suits here. That's a look. That's a look too, you know? Nah. So it's been a few minutes and... That's what my cart looks like. We're currently going through athletic bottoms and right now they're like moving the store stuff. I don't know why. But they are. <sighs> oh, got some Adidas. Not really cute, but whatever. So, first shirt so far. I got this hard rock couture, I think it says. Couture, yeah. Hard rock couture with the devils. We got this hard rock shirt with the white stitching, which is pretty cute. Got this Lucky Brand. I'm not sure if I want it because it's kind of pilly. Um, update. My mom found this Harley Davidson. And it's Orlando. And I like the color. The purple with the orange. That's pretty cute. We might get that. But what I'm trying to show y'all is this. This is Christian Ang... So whatever. Christian Engelsler who makes Ed Hardy. So I found like basically two Ed Hardy shirts. This orange one and this pink one, which I love. Like, look at that. Yes. With the tiger. Um, I found this shirt, polka dots, you know, polka dots are in, it's tied. Like, it's like a little sailor girl. North Stars, because that's like Minnesota. And then this plain guest t-shirt that just says guest on the pocket. And then like I said, the Harley Davidson shirt my mom just found. So those are some of the tops that I found. Oh no, my coffee in this row of clothing. So yeah. So what we have so far right now is this Tommy denim jacket. I found a silk long sleeve, so we're gonna try that on and see how that works. Harley Davidson. We got Victory, don't know if I'll get it if not. My mom says it's like a motorcycle brand. I'm not really sure. Um, I got this like super cool polo jeans company sweatshirt. That's super vintage looking. I'm gonna buy that. Um, got this Nike sports bra, I thought it was cute. 
And then the shirt that's literally $2. This is okay, fine, whatever. So those are some tops. And then we got a bunch of bottoms. <laughs> got some big star shorts. Uh this pink skirt. Religion. Just a bunch of jeans and stuff we're gonna try on. Well, I'm gonna try on. And then over here we got some dresses. <laughs> so Time to organize this to what I'm trying on and what I'm selling or just getting, stuff like that, so yeah. Okay, so I did not vlog in the fitting room because we were like 10 minutes till close and I was just like, let me, I feel rude just staying here, so let me just try on and get what I want. So I'm gonna do a try on haul when I get home. I don't know if you can see me because of the sun. Yeah, we're driving, woo. But um, I'll do a try on haul of everything that I got and what I'm selling and stuff like that. So I'll see you when I get home. All right, so I am back home. Um, I thought I would do a little thrift haul of what I got. Okay, hat. Um, and I'm doing a try on haul on the stuff that I'm keeping, but I'll show the stuff that like I'm selling possibly and that will be up on my Depop which you should check out. It will be in the description below if you want to go check it out. Like I just said. Okay. Yeah. So I went to two Goodwills. The first Goodwill, um, just bought like two things basically. Um, I have the receipt here. I bought, well, I say I didn't buy this. But, um, what was the tax accessory? What, the purse? And the belt's not taxed? What? Okay, Goodwill. Um, so... Um, I got this like Fendi purse. Don't know if it's real. I think I showed you guys in the blog clip. But it's like cute and it's like, you know, part of that vintage like designer brand purse like thing going on. There's a few stains on it so we're gonna try to get it out and see if it, it comes out English, yeah. Um, but it's this Fendi. So, and it's pink. It's super cute. Yeah. And then I bought myself a belt. I mean... It has two holes. I like these kind of belts with the two. And it's nice. It's thick. I don't think it's plastic. It's more leathery. My other one is like plasticky. The one I was wearing, I took it off because like I hate it. <laughs> oh, it's Sonoma and it's leather. Thank you, Sonoma, for making this. Um, and it was $1.99. So that's all I got at one Goodwill. But the next Goodwill, we got some goods. So the first thing is I feel like gonna sell real quick on my Depop. I hope it does. It's this like polo jeans company sweatshirt pullover. Um, it has it on the little Val Florian sleeve, you know, but and it has the little thing on the bottom. I don't know. It looks super vintagey and um, probably put it on my Depop sometime. Up on my Depop. So yeah. Next is this cropped Tommy Hilfiger or Tommy jeans, I should say, a uh, denim jacket, super cute. I've got the little flag, right, I don't know, can you see it, right there, and then on the back, so, that will probably be up on my Depop. Very spring, denim jackets, so spring. I showed you guys these in the store, they are the Christian, I don't even know how to say his last name, like Ed Hardy kind of thing designed shirts this one is a pink striped one with ed hardy stuff all over it and this one is christian a digger <laughs> i don't know but i know he's he's like ed hardy stuff so that's like ed hardy stuff you know, i showed you in the store and then the hard rack cafe i guess like all that can kind of like go together because it's all like tattoo-y and then it has like the contrast like Stitching that's in, so woohoo. So the next portion of this is stuff that I am keeping up for right now. I mean, I might sell it in like the future, but I'm doing a try on haul for what I got and I'll explain it of everything and yeah. <laughs> so these pants um, I got, I usually wouldn't like gravitate towards these like design of pants, but I got them because they are current Elliot which is a brand out in Nordstrom, if you guys didn't know. And they have the tags on them right here. They are ripped off, but I mean, they're pretty new. I'm pretty sure it was like a defect because the button is weird, but I mean, it still works. 
but I thought for $9.99, why not get them? And I need some crazy pants. All I have is like blue jeans and black skinnies. So why not get some cool designed pants for a low cost? Next are these Abercrombie and Fitch. Um, they just fit me really well, and I know their jeans are a little pricier, not as like high as the current Elliot, but like you know, there's some nice jeans. They are ankle <laughs> ankle jeans which I wanted some, so these fit me really nice, bought them. Here we are with them. They were $4.99, so pretty good deal for these. So now these are the faves of the trip. These true religion skinny jeans. Um, they were only $8.99, all the other ones, like you saw in the vlog clips, were like 20 bucks, 15 bucks, but these bad boys were only $8.99 and I'm pretty sure it's because there's this pink little stain or dot right here I don't know if you guys can see it with the lighting but it adds character to the jeans and I could in the future like distress them up and things like that so I'm excited I have a pair of true religions now so spendy jeans at a low cost <laughs> Okay guys, uh, before we move on, I have to talk to you right down here. My mom found the actual price for those current Elliot jeans. Um, they are $340 at ASOS or ASOS. Um, yeah, if that focuses, I don't know if it will. But she found them and they're originally $340. So I think 10 bucks is pretty good for those kind of pants. Uh, yeah, next we got these Levi's. Levi's um, they are actually little boys jeans and they're a size 12 <laughs> little boys you know rocking it um and basic oh they got big pockets woo okay <laughs> um they were only $2.99 what I think I might do I kind of am okay with the leg right now I don't know I might cut them just so they're ankle and kind of frayed you know because they're a little weird straight leg and then they kind of flare out at the bottom weirdly I don't know might cut them you know they're only three dollar jeans so why not and they're Levi's so thank you little boy section okay next I'm really not a Nike girl but I saw these and I was like I need them they're basically Nike little athletic joggers um joggers yeah I would say you know the skinny bottoms as you can see don't look at my feet hate that okay but you know they fit me well they look good go me and the cash can wear them with my Air Force ones you know I don't know they were only five dollars so why not so this shirt I found literally when I was like on the like put back rack at the fitting room and it's literally what I was looking for, a silk shirt, because those are like so in, like you can tie them up like this. Let me do it real quick because it's so cute. Like, look at that. Oh, it's got little poofs in the shoulders. Oh, and it was, I believe, I think it's $4.99. I'm pretty sure I saw it. So, I didn't button it, but you get the point. It's super cute and it's super soft and like the silk is just so like, like, is it like sexy? It's like sexy. You know, like silk on a girl is like sexy. It's so, only like, super cute, super soft, super silk. <laughs> okay, we got this shirt, which like, I'm not into the polka dot trend, but apparently I am. And the shirt reminds me of like, well, when I first saw it, I thought of Betty Boop, but then now we figured out the term. It's a pinup girl, like on like guys like tattoos or like, you know, that's what I think, pinup, a pinup girl. So it's like cute, it has a little tie, and like I think you're like, I would wear it like off the shoulder-ish because I think that's cute. But I think it's supposed to be like that, so it's like a super Athena kind of thing, but I'm gonna wear it how I can because it's my shirt. Um, I have no clue what the price is, but it is by the brand Hell Bunny, right? Hell Bunny, don't know what that is, but I just think this is so cute. And like, just imagine like some shorts or like these, like, and the shirt was only $3.99, so trendy and cute. I feel like some spendy website like Nordstrom would sell this, so like, woo. So next, we have this dress. Um, I call these dresses, I think of them like in the 60s, like the box dresses. I don't know, like, 
square dresses. This one makes me not look like I'm in a potato sack. So I got it and it was only $4.99 like most of the other things. My bra strap is falling. But it's super cute flowers. Spring, summer, woohoo. Don't know when I'll wear a dress, but I have one. So my last item that I'm trying on is this cute little like tea, I, tea dress. Like it's like a trend that's going on tea dresses. It's basically like the style I want to say with it's like flower dresses, like stuff you would wear to tea. And the best part of this dress is there's pockets. Like yes, thank you. Um, do a little spin. Pretty cute, yeah. Okay. It is by the brand Mud and it was $5.99. So a dollar more than the other dress. Um, probably because it's like a newer style, I'm guessing. I don't know. But I thought it was cute for like a little picnic or something. So here we are. Again saying, why am I buying dresses when I don't really wear them? Woohoo, because they're cute. Don't got my hat on, but that's okay. Okay. So at that Goodwill, I spent a total of $52 even because, you know, me, I'm a good Samaritan and I donated the whatever cents, you know, whatever that I say. Like, would you like to donate five cents to, to round it up? Yeah, that, I did that. So $52 for all of that, I'm pretty sure that's a good deal because, come on, you got some true religion, which is like $200 jeans depending on style and stuff like that. You got current Elliot with those $340 jeans like 52 bucks for all that heck yes okay okay put the hat back on because I think I look better with it on I'm a hat person hello everyone nice to meet you I'm totally a hat person so I hope you guys enjoyed that video if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up and also make sure you comment down below do you go thrifting do you like thrifting what have you been thrifting the most let me know down below also, make sure you subscribe. I post videos every Saturday, so it gives you something to do on the weekend. Unless, you know, doing a thrift. thrift. I'm always thrifting now. I'm a thrifter YouTuber now. Woohoo, call me the next Threads Obsessed. Please don't, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not, I'm literally just like in the trend, you know? Is that a trend? Is thrifting a trend? I feel like it's a trend. But yeah, so that's about it. Thanks for watching, bye!